a warm and pleasant season greetings to all St. Lucians, and most importantly, to my beloved people of Babono. This year, 2020, was more than an eventful one. Many challenges were presented, including the worldwide pandemic of COVID-19. Despite the prevailing harsh conditions, our collective efforts were able to produce remarkable accomplishments for the year. As a government, we have not sat doing nothing. We did put programs in place which impacted positively the social and economic well-being of our people. These programs did assist in some way to cushion the negative impact of COVID-19. They were well received by the majority of residents. The, dis the distribution of food hamper to most vulnerable persons and underprivileged members within our community was an initiative of government from which many persons from Babono benefited. During the period, residents from Babono witnessed continued work to improve the water distribution in many communities. We were able to install a 50,000 gallon water tank at Wasco Hill 20 treatment plant. Work has also started for the installation of a 200,000 gallon water storage tank at Lakwa Babono. These new infrastructures would assist tremendously at improving and making our water supply more reliable. My people of Babono, I'm happy to report that the promise made last year regarding the improvement to our many major roads is either finished or is still ongoing. For example, Timon and Debawa community roads are completed. Jiwa, Plateau to Pebus Junction, via Lage, and the Savannah Ho roads work are ongoing. I have been successful to secure sponsorship for hosting the annual T20 cricket competition and the revival of the parliamentary representative football competition. During 2020, we were able to improve many sporting infrastructure. For example, we were able to complete the construction of the Timon multi-purpose court. We also built a permanent spectator stand and paid off a high electricity bill and repairs to the lighting system on the Lage playing field. I'm delighted to announce that the recognition program that started during my first term continued with presenting top performing students at the common entrance exams from schools in the community with laptops and tablets. Whilst I look forward to the coming year if a level of optimism, we will continue to focus on the many programs that will improve your living conditions. We shall see the improvement to many community roads. I can announce that the new primary school for Lage will commence early in 2021. The authorities are at the stage of finalizing the process of identifying a contractor. The Timon Community Hall will be constructed. Whilst we have finished the purchasing of the lands for the Debawa field, we shall see the continued imp improvement of expanding that field to accommodate a 400 meter track. Work will continue on the Rizina field in Gara. The expansion and improvement to the infrastructure at the Garner Cemetery will be con con continued in 2021. Attention will also be given 
to Talvan land regularization and improvement to that road. In closing, a special thanks to all who continue to provide support, advice, and prayers. We know this year has been tough, but let's spread joy and cheers during the season. Uplift others in the safest way possible and become each other's keeper. As we celebrate during the season, I call on all, especially my people of Babono, to please follow COVID-19 protocols recommended by the Ministry of Health and Wellness. May the Almighty God bless and guide you. I thank you and once again wishing all of you a joyous Christmas and a happy and prosperous New Year. I thank you.